Hi there, and welcome to the first of several short videos I'm going to be sharing with you in the hopes of starting a discussion to perhaps try to figure out what's going on with these very interesting and mysterious stone formations or um, constructions, rather, that I've come across here in the deep wilderness of my 500 acre property here in Quebec, Canada. Um, so I'll try to make it quick. What first comes to mind obviously is a farmer's clearing pile. Um, and uh, we see these all over the place. They're usually a pile of stones. The farmers used to clear fields. They usually put them around a, a big tree or a big boulder and that's it. There's one or two in a field and they're tossed um, you know, with as little as effort as possible just to clear the stones. Um, there's many reasons here why I don't think those are that. And uh, I'll start with just this pile, but as the videos evolve, you'll see that this pile is connected to other piles, which connects it to a larger uh, formation or kind of site, we'll call it, uh, that, that really, as, each, as you see each one, uh, it becomes less and less likely that these are farmers clearing piles. I mean the first and obvious thing is that this is like uh, you know seven or eight feet tall and it's a constructed wall. It's not just a pile it's being actually put together with great care and uh, some of these boulders are, are huge two three four hundred pound boulders that have been constructed to, to pile this wall. From this angle here it looks really straight um, but overall it looks to have a circular shape and uh, if you have a look at the drone footage here from above it's in fact a perfect circle it's quite clear um, you know it, it's really as, as circular as it can be and that would have had to have been engineered with quite a bit of care seeing as this is on uh, quite a um, steeply sloped hillside so to make something look like a circle assuming it's not a total coincidence, um, to make something look like a circle from above on a steep slope, it would have to be engineered so that you're building basically an ellipse on the ground. Um, the next reason I don't think it's a stone pile is that I have several other stone piles on this property. This is an old farm, the original European settlers, about 150 years old, um, and there are stone piles. There was a big hay barn, so they were cultivating hay here for their milk cows. Um, so there are several stone piles and they don't look anything like this. They're not constructed. They're just top piled in a pile like you see with other farmers stone piles. So if it's not a stone pile then what could it be? Okay if it's the European settlers maybe it was, I thought it was some sort of a foundation for something. A couple of reasons it's really not a foundation is a foundation for what? It's a circular column that's full in the middle. It's not a rec rectangular, you know, it's not a perimeter with which you would build uh, a timber structure on top of. It's a totally filled in construction of these big, huge stones that are in a circular fashion on this steep slope. Um, again, if it was some sort of a foundation for something, well, where's the timber from the rest of the structure? If right down at the compound, my log home is still in perfect shape on a stone foundation, but the, the wood is still there perfectly. Same with the barn, same with the original, original outbuilding log house, the logs are still there. Uh, the European settlers have only been here for about 150 years, so it would take a lot longer than that for that wood stuff to just disappear. Um, I've heard uh, thoughts of it maybe being a lime kiln. I've had one of the local fifth generation farmers over to check it out and uh, he says there's no way it's a lime kiln. It was just not built like that. Again, it's fil filled in the middle um, and so it just doesn't make any sense that it would be a lime kiln. Um, now I want to also point out that uh, I'm quite sure it's not uh, any of the First Nation tribes that we know from this area. Uh, these in particular around here were the Algonquins and they there's no history of them building anything with stone. Uh, nothing ritual or, or um, no burial sites. 
no, no homes or structures. They didn't work with stones. So it's not them. Um, I mean, that's all I'm going to say about this one. Please uh, comment. I'd really love to hear what you think about this. Uh, please share this video with anyone else you think might know something about it or might be interested in this ongoing mystery. Um, I will be I will be sharing a bunch more videos to reveal a lot more of these structures that I found. This is the first video because this is the first structure. Um, there it is. In my opinion, this is not built by the first European settlers. Uh, and so, who did it and why? Um, thanks a lot for sticking with me through this. I hope you share this, comment on it, and join me for the next one that I'm going to put up really soon. Uh, there's several of these and they're all unique in their construction. Um, so let's see if we can figure that out, this out. Uh, it's pretty fun. It's pretty weird. All right. Have a nice day. Thanks.